branch stock account branch debtors account and branch petty cash account all three comes under branch account rent and taxes salary office expense all goes to branch stock debit side opening balance goods sent to branch head office expenses petty cash credit side cash collected cash sales goods returned to branch along with closing balances a warm welcome to one and all this is your other sir here so let's learn vidya ashram first grade college the temple of excellence now we are discussing your unit number 1 in the financial accounting 2 of your bcom second semester that is called branch accounting so today we will discuss the topic called branch accounting and we will understand what is branch accounting what are the topics what are the accounts we are going to open or prepare and what is the procedure before we go to problem understand under branch accounting there are why do we prepare branch accounting for example if there is a head office under head office there are two or three branches will be there individual branch have their own accounting things or transactions individual accounting transactions are prepared once they done with individual branch accounting transactions they will send it to the head office after head office what they will do they will take all the transaction of individual branches they will merge and make a final statement now now we are not doing any final statement any merging part nothing we are taking only one individual branch in that branch what are the sales happened what is the purchases happened normally whatever we do everything is dependent branch so there is no purchases everything comes under sales only now in this all the branch stock account branch debtors account and branch petty cash account all three comes under branch account which are those three branch stock branch debtors branch petty cash we'll go one by one i'll explain you the branch accounting with a small problem now jyoti laboratory mumbai has a branch at bangalore to which goods are invoiced at cost plus 25 this is very important cost plus 25 why cost plus 25 means it is nothing but they are issuing with profit it is nothing but invoice price invoice price they are issuing at what price invoice price now make sales both for cash and credit for the following particular relating to year 2002 prepare bangalore branch account head office ledger all the details they have given now simple one simple one branch stock you should remember the format under branch stock what will come simple one now here to opening balance under opening balance all the opening balances like stock debtors petty cash furniture all the opening balances will come once you done with opening balances next will go with goods sent to branch gsb goods sent to branch then to head office any expenses made or any petty cash paid to the branch these are the things comes under branch stock account what will come under credit side simple one cash collected cash collected any cash collected we should take it under credit side next cash sales any sales related to cash that will come under credit side along with that goods returned to branch goods returned to branch branch has taken goods from head office they felt that 
there is a damage in the goods then what they are supposed to do they have to give it back that is called goods return to branch once you done with this all the closing balances whatever opening balance you have written stock debtors petty cash furniture everything will come this is what your branch stock account hope you are clear now debit side opening balance goods sent to branch head office expenses petty cash credit side cash collected cash sales goods return to branch along with closing balances now usually what happens opening balance and closing balance of stock opening balance of stock closing balance of stock they will give it an invoice price whenever they give invoice price opposite side opposite side you have to find out stock reserve stock reserve means what whatever profit included you have to remove that whatever profit included you have to remove that that is called as your branch stock account hope you are clear yes now in the problem they have given stock debtors petty cash furniture prepaid prepaid remember it comes under debit side you have to see whether it is a opening prepaid closing prepaid opening prepaid always debit outstanding salary if it is a opening then it will go to credit goods sent to branch at invoice price you know that way to write goods sent to branch hope you are clear goods returned by branch this also you know that goods returned to branch will come this side then cash sales you know that way to write cash received from debtors credit sales will go to debtors account i'll show you debtors first you learned branch stock now i'll show you debtors account under debtors account simple one here two balance brought down whatever opening balances you have we will write two credit sales two only two things balance brought down credit sales then it will be by cash collected cash collected by discount by bad debts by any allowances by bills receivable by goods returned by customer goods returned by branch will be branch stock goods returned by customer here and the last one by balance carry down this will be your format clear now in this your credit sales goods returned by customer bad debts as you know that goods returned by customer where it goes credit side your bad debts where it goes credit side expenses paid by head office branch stock rent and taxes salary office expense all goes to branch stock 11 months they have given still one month is what outstanding so in a year how many months we have 12 they have given how many months 11 one month we have to consider as outstanding balance means it will be insurance balance your closing balance stock at invoice price petty expenses made by branch this will go to petty cash account hope you are clear later i'll go out of the screen you can take screenshots provide depreciation on furniture 10% your opening furniture is how much yes 125 for this minus what 10% depreciation you are supposed to do hope you are clear good so in the books of jyoti laboratory mumbai head office this is what branch stock account whatever i explain you keep it in mind so similarly we have done here opening branch stock yes debtors petty cash furniture prepaid as i told you prepaid always comes under debit side similarly goods sent to branch yes 
then any expenses made by head office see rent salary office petty cash insurance all put together 82000 outstanding salary as i told you out of 12 one month is pending 33000 into 1 by 11 it is 3000 goods sent to branch 6 this is what stock reserve why it is taken 125 means in the question they have mentioned what cost plus 25% always cost assumed as 100 plus 25 we call it as 125 yeah so these are the things debit items we have taken now i'll go back to your credit item your credit item now outstanding salary whatever given we have taken by bank remittances like cash sales cash collected from customers total both and write it in outer column any balance carried on from branch stock it is there 30000 similarly your branch debtors petty cash furniture prepared all the closing balances we have returned then stock reserve means what for your opening balance there is a 1 lakh i'll show you 1 lakh is your opening balance on that we have calculated 25 by 125 there is a stock reserve good sent to branch it is how much there is also 1 10 lakh into 25 by 125 these are the stock reserve we have done once you total everything you have to see there is a net profit of 1 lakh 11000 950 hope you are clear yes now these are the working note working note in the sense your branch debtors account opening debtors credit sales as i told you what is the format similarly go to credit side if there is any cash collected bad debts goods returned by customer remember this the difference will be called as your branch debtors closing balance hope you are clear yes So once you done with this, these are the working note for your petty cash. What is the opening petty cash? Like two thousand five hundred. Anything collected from head office? Yes, four thousand. Total six thousand five hundred. Out of that, how much you spent? Four thousand five hundred. Remaining is how much? Two thousand. This will be called as closing balance. Closing balance of petty cash. Furniture. It was one lakh twenty five. Minus ten percent depreciation. Your answer is how much? One lakh twelve five hundred. Simple, simple thing and small, small working note. This petty cash. Remember, you can do it in a format. You can do it in a format. Or else, you can do it separately. Clear? In this branch account, the major thing is branch stock account. The petty cash and debt account, which are supportive. to branch stock account i'll go out of the screen please take screenshots your problem continuation solution part your solution part working note your working note for petty cash and furniture so this is all about your branch stock account so whatever concept i told you please apply that and whatever notes given in that more than 5 to 6 problems are there please work out those problems thank you